so so this is the student this is the student github um github benefit home page so once you get to this home page you have to make sure you're in the right home page if you don't know how to get to this home page you can just search for it on on the internet just put um github student pack you're in the right home page when you click this link so it's going to take us back to its place and then we sign in when you're signed in to your page like this you go to um, explore more offer it says student developer pack offers explore more offers GitHub's there uh -huh. then you scroll down it says virtual event kit hackathon in the cloud intro to web so it depends on what you want if you want to do hackathon in the cloud like if you're in hackathon in the cloud means like if you're in a competition all these hackathon competitions that they do and it has to do with cloud services like uh, microsoft google uh, um, aws all those kind of benefits you just come here and you click learn more or you can select exactly the offer you want so it, it depends on what you're looking for me i'm looking for cloud offers um okay no not cloud let's go for domain offers i'm looking for domain offers so i'm going to click domains so it's going to open all the offers that have to do with domains that these are this after clicking domains you can see that domains are, is now highly highlighted and then these are the domains these are um, offers that these are platforms that are in partnership with github and they're ready to give you free offers i've used this name chip I've used this name chip um, platform before, so I'm going to just use it again. I don't want to tamper with any of my other benefits from name name.com and tech domains. So let me show you how I use my name chip. So I clicked um, gain access by connecting your GitHub account to name chip. I click this. Here it says, as you can see, here it says one year domain name registration on the dot metld so this is one of your benefits you can read the benefits that you gain from these companies this first one says uh, one year um, domain name registration this second one says build your online presence with a free live domain so your domain is going to be any so something something dot live so you can put it um, my domain dot live or my blog dot live or hello world dot live any any domain you're creating here for free is going to be dot live just this one is going to be dot me any domain i i want for free here yeah, is going to have dot me i can't get a dot com for free and here too i can't get a dot com for free and i don't think you can you can ever get a dot com for free you always get dot me dot live dot co dot something strange huh? uh -huh. so um, this one says one one standard tech domain free okay dot tech so this one is dot tech so you have your your domain name is going to be my 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 domain dot tech or your name you can use roland dot tech or anybody like we're going to click this okay we've already clicked this so this is where it's going to open so you say claim your free domain i've already claimed my free domain so it's not if i if i put any domain now i'm going to pay for it because i've already gotten my free domain so i'm going to put what i want my dot me to be so let's say i call it um roland domain roland roland domain so it's going my my domain name is now going to be roland domain dot me so i can now click um i click find so i can even add roland domain dot me for free it even says free i even thought uh it says i can still create your limited time me domain are free for students so it seems i can create another domain for free i thought it was a one-time purchase but i think i can do it twice or more so if i click add this domain now will belong to me on the name chip account on the name chip platform if i click add when i log into it's going to take me i don't want to add this to my domain because i don't need it so if i click add it's going to take me to name the name dot chip for um, name the chip platform where i will now have my own um okay let me log in let me log into my name the chip my details and i'm going to show you how their platform looks github pack 
so now i have this account and i should have a domain i have a domain here yeah. i have this domain created on created on this name dot chip account so this is how you uh, this is this domain will be here this is your dashboard all this you can get to know how, what all this do but for now we just want domain so i'm going to click domain list i just want to show how to navigate this so it's going to show your domain list is going to show your domain here uh let's i'm going to tick this then i'm going to say manage it says active because this this website is actually active if you go to roland all school dot me it's going to open a website for you so um, yeah so now this domain is going to belong to you but this place this custom dns is going to be empty i'm the one that inserted all this it's going to be empty i'm going to later show you how to connect your um your server to, to your name chip account but not in this video i'll make another video for that so that's all you need to do once you click your domain and you come here you put all these addresses here and you click save save is going to appear here and then you click save and then all and then this account this roland this domain sorry this domain name is going to now be linked to your server all this information is going to be gotten from your server your server is going to give you all this link to link to your domain so i think we are good to go that's just how to make use of the student github pack if you want another pack if you want to make use of another pack you can click cloud and then anything related to cloud will appear let's see what happens let's see what the offers for cloud let's see the offers for cloud so yeah so about microsoft azure the benefit is free access to 25 microsoft azure cloud this one says enjoy 200 dollars in platform credit this one is oh this is digital ocean so this is how you can get 200 dollars from digital ocean and then you can click here you can click get access by connecting so if i click here i think i don't have this offer so let me try it yeah so i can log in i can sign in i can sign in always use this signing with github it makes things easier because it will once you sign in with github it realizes that you're a student and then the student offer can just be activated automatically so we won't be doing that in this video but